So can you give some examples of what God's love... We do the opposite. Exactly, because yeah. we rescue instead. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, God's love does not withhold from us the truth about ourselves, yep. but rather exposes the truth at every moment through the laws of attraction, cause and effect, and sh through these laws showing us our own conditions, our own condition and attractions all the about time. what is happening. Yep. Yeah. So God's love isn't withholding information mm. about ourselves from us. Yeah. God, in fact, created a huge amount of laws to give us information <laughs> about the truth about ourselves. Yeah. yeah. God's love does not give us pep talks, no. lectures, no. arguments, or how we should hey. act, behave or feel. Yes. And God's love doesn't prepare us for the future way we should act. Yeah. Right. God's love is always encouraging us to feel how we feel right now and act upon how we feel right now in harmony with love. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. God's love does not show us where we've gone wrong when we're not open to seeing that truth. Exactly. Or when we're avoiding the truth or finding out other truth. Yes. So God's love, in other words, doesn't expose the truth to us unless we want the truth as well. So we've mm -hmm. got to want it. It doesn't, it's sort of like, there's all these laws that expose the truth to us, but, but the, I suppose this, the flavour is this, is that yeah. it, it doesn't sort of, um, those truths cannot enter us unless we're willing to absorb them. So yeah, this and this is, this is interesting because you've been discussing all these points in relationship, uh, in regards to, to a having relationship. a relationship. Yeah. Um, and so one of the previous points was that God's love never withholds truth from exactly. us. So if I'm considering that in my relationship, mm -hmm. then I would never withhold truth from, truth from my partner. Exactly. But in this point, we're saying um, God's love doesn't actually show us where we've gone wrong unless we want truth. So how would I, how would I marry those two well, principles within a relationship? Well, the best way to probably think of it is that God's love doesn't, the truth of what God's love is attempting to show us doesn't actually enter us unless there is an openness within ourselves to desire the truth to enter us. Mm -hmm. We see this happening in relationships all the time, if you think about it. Yeah. If, if you tell you the truth to a partner and they don't want to know it, it doesn't enter them. 